Hey guys, this is Lava Thorpe, and welcome back to Lava Craft. I've been up here at Kane at my Cloud in the Sky for my creeper form. Let me grab all my gear, and we can head on right down. Let's um, why might why might why might? Anyways, though, I have some really great plans to build a shop, a firework shop, and I'm gonna go gather some stuff. And after I grab my this stuff. I'll get back to you guys and we can kind of start working on that guys i just spent the last like two hours gathering supplies um i got it all into these three shulker boxes see stuff 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 to build the new shop the rocket shop it's super cool i gotta find a spot let's go scout out a nice spot okay guys i got a little spot right here just just right here um it, it's gonna be kind of up in the air so i just gonna have it floating above here um I don't want to give it away. I'll just see as it gets built, but it's going to be my rocket shop. I think this should work. Hopefully it's not too close to that portal. Hopefully it's not too close to Heaven's portal. I think right here, um, it's going to be pretty tall, but I'm really excited. I'm really excited. I've spent the whole day making this in creative. I think here, it's going to be a little hard to build because I have to build a little bit in the air, but yeah, let's get right into it. Woo! The shop is done. If you guys can see it right there, let's go fly over to it. I think it came out fantastic. It has these little landing pads right here. You just go and, oh look at that, perfect landing, land right here. You just hop off, get a good scenic view of everything as you look around. I think you can see my base from here, yeah. See my base from here. And yeah, let's do a quick little tour of it. Let's do the outside. We have this giant gravity stone made out of amethyst that is magically powered that uh, enables the thing to float with all these lights attached to it. Um, outside, uh, we got these big roof designs with the mangrove wood, something new I tried. We got a flickering light. Who knows what's going on there? Some sort of uh, magic contraption. The Wi Fi is out. Uh, and then more roof on the top. Lots of lights, lots of different colors. I think it came out very nice. Kind of gives me a Castlevania feel, like the castle from Castlevania. But let's go inside. So we have the the main hall here with me. Pray all praise with the Wizard of Lava. I like to have been trying to do more decorations and stuff. Little bibs and bobs and things in here. Look, there's random books. If we go down to the store, this this whole level is the whole store. I'm going to put rockets and wings, and I went ahead and put all, a bunch of end loot I had laying around. And then, for those that don't have wings, they'll have to go through the end portal. End portal's down here at the bottom, so you can get into it from here. This just goes to the end. I had some desyncing issues with the spawn one, but we're figuring that out. And then I have three shop guardians. I have the elder guardians I fought a while ago. See, they're three heads. They will protect my shop from any intruders, so... But then we just come back up to here. We can hop over here and just fly right off. Whee! I think it's pretty fantastic. 
Um, I'm thinking people are getting confused because it's not attached to the ground. They're like, how do I get in it? But I'm I'm sure they'll figure it out. The amethyst looks very nice too. It looks especially especially good at dark. But I got some rockets. Let's go ahead and um, get these boxes in here, and we can probably go ahead and open it up with what we have. Let's put these in. I got a box of holding with a, and wings, rockets, and a book that says these are this is an official wing of flying. If I see here. Say wings of flame, copyright, official wizard license, and a bunch of rockets. You know, just what you need. Let's go get the rocket boxes. I got half of them done. I've been, <laughs> guys, I have been doing a huge grind on these stupid rockets. I'm so sick of them. I got about half of them done. It's just, it's a lot of shuriken, a lot of gunpowder. So let's collect what we do have, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. And we'll take these over and fill these up and open up the shop. Oh look, it even looks beautiful from right here. We'll just come on down here and shove these guys in. These aren't named or anything, I'm just putting them in. We're doing 64 for a box of rockets, 64 for wings. These are kind of high priced because I don't really plan on restocking it. We got some novice wizard tools, three for a diamond, and we got master wizard tools, one diamond each. Just, just some extra stuff laying around I had. And the shop is now officially opened! So come get your, oops, come get your crap at, at my, oh, the shop's name is Upcast Rockets and More. Because it's flying and like you also have like upcasting spells. It's perfect. I love it. It's such a cool shop. Let me know what your guys' favorite feature of the shop is and what you think of it. I think it turned out really well. But that's enough of the shop. Uh, we have a new member joining, Seth. We've been trying to get hold of him for a bit, but we think he's really nice and cool. So let's go ahead and go and introduce him. Today right. we have with us uh, Seth. He is our newest member. He applied like three years ago and he didn't know how Discord worked. But we got him in finally, woo! Now he's stuck I made forever. it, I'm here. <laughs> uh Seth, tell us tell us the weirdest thing about yourself. Uh weirdest thing about me? Um Uh I, I sleep with no covers. Oh, that's that is that is pretty weird. Okay, we gotta kick you out. Anyways, go watch uh <laughs> Seth's videos and uh check out the link tree if you wanna see his stuff and welcome in and woo! Um let's head over to my base. I'm gonna get Seth to come over because as you guys know I like to collect everyone's heads, so I'm gonna use my traditional trap of using the wall to try and collect his head before he gets too strong and too much armor and becomes impossible to kill. Uh here, I'm gonna show you something. Come here. Um see oh first i'm gonna i'm gonna ask you a question here come to my bed here right click my bed do you like red beds or white beds better um red beds naturally yeah they're the og beds right Mm-hmm. okay come here come here i'll show you the wall so if you build near the wall feel free to replace it in your section like i've done so like i'm not done with it but one thing i'm doing yeah is I'm adding some like puzzle to the other side. I want to want to ask you this because I got coarse dirt. Yeah, yeah. And I'm adding like this little bit of puzzle and stuff. Thank you. Sorry about that. The Seth. funny thing. I needed your the head. The funny thing. I needed your the head funny for my thing collection. Is the funny thing is you told me about that, and I was still like, <laughs> okay, yeah. Let me look at this puzzle. We did it, guys. And you made me we sleep in the head. bed. Like, I knew I knew it was coming. <laughs> That's so funny. I was like, oh, yeah, okay, let me look at this block. So we got Seth's head. It's right here permanently next to JJ's now. And we still got to get Heavens. I haven't seen her on recently. But Nick, Neons, and Dyson's are also going to be kind of hard. We still got them. But I think the headroom is coming along very nice. Speaking of heads, earlier in the week, we pranked Milo. He was AFK a whole lot, a whole lot. And so we went over to his base and put on a dragon head and gave it curse of being stuck on your head forever. Let's go over and I'm going to go ahead and show that footage now. Roll the tape. We are at Milo's base because he's been AFK all day. And we have a special head day. for him. 
we have this cool little AFK dragon head with the Curse of Binding. We're going to try and shove it on his head. Oh, just go in, and go inside of it, then fly up. Oh, no, I don't want to face him up. Oh, he picked up the dispenser. Oh, crap. I just need a crafting table. It's okay. I just need a crafting table. <laughs> I need to make a bow. And... Dispenser. Okay. Okay. Come on. Okay, let me get out of his way. Hold on. I gotta come around to the other side. Fly! Fly! Fly like the wind! Okay. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Okay. Okay, ready? Watching? I'm watching. Yeah! <laughs> we did it. We did it. Okay, let's destroy all evidence that we are here. Okay. It's Milo. Turn around. Let's all let's all get a group picture with with Milo. I'll stand over here. Let me do F1. And where's his head? There is Milo. Okay, no, I got one. It'll work. It's his back's turned to us, but that's that's pretty okay for Milo. <laughs> It's a lot of iron. Hey, bro. Ow. Look, I fell back dragon. in. dragon. Let's kill it. <laughs> All right. Kill All right. the dragon, uh, do you, rogue. Do you have... Rogue, kill do the dragon. String? Do you have... Do you have string? Kill the dragon. Uh, string. String. It's a, how, string. Who spawned ah, the dragon What the in heck? Here? What the heck? Who ah, who what the, the heck is this in my head? Kill the dragon. Oh, the oh my kill god. The dragon. <laughs> <laughs> when the fire? When Get did him. you put this in my head? <laughs> Just take it off, Milo. It's all good. Just take it off. I can take it off. Curse oh! of binding. Hopefully you're recording. Oh, that sounds like a you problem. <laughs> I'm not. I, was, I thought it was a quick. That was a quick transaction. Well, it's always good fun tormenting Milo. We'll have to come up with some more pranks for him. But that's all I really got for you guys this week. It's going to be a shorter episode. I am going on a business trip in two days, and I'm trying to get this video out today. And so it's going to be a little shorter. I mean, I spent most of it doing time lapse and rockets and that kind of stuff, so that's just that's just the way it is. But we're gonna try and work on a copper farm. I know I've been saying that for like five episodes uh, next week, and get uh, working on our mega base. But until then, you guys have a great week and a great day. And oh, I can zoom in and out with this. Whoa. Whoa. Anyways, uh, you guys have a great day, and I will see you guys next week. Woo!